Okay, hi guys, number 121 today. So obviously I'm not in my regular gym, um, but we're gonna try to make this work because I want to still keep recording some workouts. I am right next to a packed beach, so there will be background noise. You might hear children, cars, mopeds, trucks, um, but hopefully my voice will carry and you'll be able to hear me over all that and go on with the workout as usual. Um, my equipment is limited, so what I am using today will be my barbell, a kettlebell, and a variety of dumbbells. I'm going from 5 pounds to 20 pounds with my dumbbells. Um, I just, I pretty much took every dumbbell set I have here, and I'm just going to use that, all right? As well as my elevation. So, if you don't have an elevation, no worries, it would be helpful. Um, if you have something that you can move laterally on, that's even better and I will be using the bench behind me as my elevation. Uh, and that is pretty much it. Everything I'm doing, you can do with your dumbbell, so you don't need any equipment like the uh, barbell or the kettlebell, okay? So what I'm doing is I'm gonna be doing a workout that's going to have compound moves, four moves that will stay the same throughout the whole workout. We'll have three sets of those same moves each time we change the format. So the first time we're doing it for reps, Second time we're doing it for timed intervals, and the third time it will be broken down into a Tabata pair. In between those compound moves, I will be doing as many rounds as possible, and every minute on the minute, all right? So hopefully it will be a pretty quick workout, efficient, total body, and we're going to get started. Please make sure you warm up. It is very, very hot where I'm at, so I think I will be warmed up very quickly. All right, we are starting off, like I said with our compound moves, which I will be using my barbell for. We're gonna do 10 box squats to start, all right? So, 10 box squats, you can definitely use your dumbbells, like I said, getting it up over my shoulders. Gonna sit fully onto wherever you're sitting and come up, pushing through the heels. All right, here we go. One. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Keep all that weight in the heels as you stand up. Nine and ten. Bring it over. We're going into clean and press. I'm gonna stick with my barbell, 10 reps. Gonna clean right below my knees. Bring it up, clean it, press it. Sorry, I'm, I'm gonna hang right below my knees. Two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, and ten. Bring it down. We are moving on to a sumo deadlift high pull. So knees and toes are out. High pull with your dumbbells or your barbell, all right, or your sandbag, whatever you're using. 10 reps, chest is up, at the top, bring those elbows out, here we go, toes, knees out, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Whew. All right. Last exercise in this set. Decline push-ups. So no equipment needed. If you don't have a decline, regular push-ups. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. All right, already sweating. <laughs> that is 
Your compound set, first set done. We are moving on to as many rounds as possible. Four minutes. I will be using just my kettlebell, all right? Which is a little bit over 30 pounds. And that's all I'm gonna be using. You can definitely do everything with dumbbells. Four minutes, we're gonna be doing four plank hops, clean it up, goblet squat, four reps, four swing, sorry, four squat swings. So you sit into a squat and swing, four alternating full release lunges. So again, you hold it like a goblet, full release, knee up, all right? So we're alternating those. Four reps of everything, four minutes total. Here we go. Starting my clock now in three, two, and go. So we're doing plank hop, clean it up, goblet squat, that's one. Two. Three. And four. Four swings, two squats. One, two, three, and four. You can set your kettlebell down. This is not a complex. Four goblet, alternating full release. Lunge, we are reverse lunge, knee up. So, reverse lunge, one. Bring that knee all the way, all the way down the floor, two. Three, and four. Back to the top. Plank hop, clean goblet squat. One. You're past your first minute mark. Two. Three. And four, set that weight down, squat to swing, squat swings. Here we go. One, two, three, and four. Woo, goblet. Reverse lunge, full release, knee up. One, two, Three, and four. Back to the top, planks. Halfway, more than halfway. One, you guys know the moves. If you can go faster, do it. Two. Three. It is very hot here today. And Four, swings into a squat, four reps. One, two, three, four. Woo, goblet, reverse lunge, knee up. One, two, three, one minute. And four. Final minute, come on. One. Two. Three. Four. Squat to sit. Swing to squat, rather. Right? You guys know the move. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Goblet. Come on, let's get these in. You have 15 seconds. One, reverse lunge knee up. Full release. Two, three, and four. Exactly four minute mark. Good job, guys. It is such a huge difference working out outside as opposed 
to an air conditioned room. So I'm gonna grab my water. We are moving on to every minute on the minute. Cardio focus. All right. I'm gonna only be using my five pound weights for this. Everything else is gonna be body weight move. First move, plank hop, weighted star jump. You don't need the light weights, I'm just gonna use my five pounds, all right? Plank hop into a weighted star jump. Eight reps of everything. I'll explain as we go, here we go. Anytime you have left in that minute is your rest. In three, two, go. So plank hop, star jump, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Thirty seconds remaining. We are doing a curtsy knee drive. So we curtsy, curtsy, drive that knee up. All right, eight on each leg. You have 15 seconds. Grab your water, 10 seconds. And five, four, so I'm sticking with my left leg first. Two, and go. So curtsy, knee up. One, two, three, four, Get down low, five, six, seven, eight. Switch it up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Whew. 25 seconds. Next move, if you have your elevation, box drop, so you're just dropping down into a knee tuck or a tuck jump. All right, so from your elevation, you still have 10 seconds, tuck, jump down, hop down, fall down, drop, tuck it up. All right, you drop. Here we go. Eight reps, so bring it up, drop down, immediately tuck those knees, that's one. Watch your head, two, three, drop it down, tuck it up, four, five, six, land soft, seven, and eight, uh, 20 seconds. Last move, knee tuck on the floor. So you bring your knees in, bring it down, back up. All right, you don't release the hands, but you bring that chest all the way down. Eight reps, here we go. So go, knee tuck, bring it down, push it back up, one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Uh, 30 seconds. That was our last move on the every minute on the minute. All right. We go back to our compound move, our compound set. This time, we're going for time. So 50 seconds, 10 second break. All right, same four moves, but we're doing it for time. Whew. So starting 50 seconds, I'm gonna use my barbell again. Loading it up, we have the box squats. In three, two, and go. 
50 seconds. You have plenty of time. Watch your form. Push through those heels to stand. Guys, this is the first workout here. So it's a bit experimental. But I'm gonna to try to work with the space I have and the equipment I have. 20 seconds and hopefully keep recording. Ten seconds. Three, two, and one. We have clean and press. Ten reps. Hang and clean into a press. In three, two, and go. Fifty seconds. Clean it up. Press it up. You can do a push press if you need to. Halfway there. Twenty seconds. Sumo deadlift. Pull it up. Power it up. Come on. 30 seconds. 50 seconds and go pace yourselves go faster than me slower the heat definitely slows me down 30 seconds Come on. Ten seconds. Body tight. Four, three, two, and one. So, second set of compound moves done. All right. We have another as many rounds as possible. This time it's six minutes. Water up. It's another three moves. We are doing reverse lunge, no full release, just a regular reverse lunge, lateral raise at the top. All right, six reps. Then we're doing a plank hop, dumbbell high pull, all right? Plank hop, bring it up, just like we did with the barbell, or if you're using dumbbells, you're doing it again. You can even substitute your kettlebell. Then we're doing dumbbell rows, all right? We're gonna do dumbbell row, walk it out, push up, walk back in, six reps. So we're gonna try to go through as many rounds as we can of these. Here we go, I'm gonna go with my tens. And I'm gonna go with my 
nearly 20s for the high pull. All right, so here we go. Starting my time, six minutes in three, two, and go. So reverse lunge, alternating, standing up, lateral raise. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, plank cop, high pull. Here we go. So no push up, hop it back, hop it in, bring it up, one, two, three, four, five, six, Woo. row, walk it out, push up, six reps, one row, drop the weight, walk it out for a push up. Now you know the moves, go quicker if you can. One, walk it back, pick up the weights, bend the knees, rowing. Two. Three. Four. Get that chest to the floor. Five. Weights to your pockets. Last one. Walk it out, push up. And six. Reverse lunge. Lateral raise. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Plank hop, high pull. You're at your halfway mark. Come on. If you can, go quicker than I am. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. And six. Row. Walk it out, push up. Woo. Drop those weights, walk it out, push up. One. Two. Three. You have two minutes. Four. Five. Six. Walk it out for that push up. All right. Reverse lunge. Lateral raise. Minute and a half. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five. 
Okay. And six. Plank up, high pulls. Let's try to get these in. Come on. One. Put power into that pull. Two. Three. Four. Bend those knees to support the lower back. Five. And six. 30 seconds. Row. Walk it out. As many as you can give me in 20 seconds. Ten. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right. Guys, that was the last every minute on the minute. We are on to our last, sorry, that was our last as many rounds as possible. We are on to our last every minute on the minute. So, the only weight I will be using, well, I will try to stick with my almost 20 pounds. All right, we are starting with a 180 degree box jump. If you don't have a box, you do this on the floor. All right, so 180 degrees, watch if there's nothing around you. One foot on, switch, don't hit your head, and switch. I'll be ducking a little bit, all right? Keep your chest up if you don't have something that you're gonna hit your head on like I do. Here we go. We're going for 12 reps. We are going for one minute. Whatever you have left is your break. I'm starting with clock now in three, two, and go. 12 reps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. You have 40 seconds. I wanted a longer break here to let you catch your breath. We are going lateral lunge, pop squat at the center. So, lateral lunge together. Sorry, pop squat. We're going to pop squat it. Not another knee tuck. All right? So, lateral lunge, feet together. Pop squat. In five, 12 reps. Four, three, two. So I'm counting on my pop squats. Go. Lateral lunge. Hips are back, butt is back. Oh, pop squat. One. Don't know why I'm stuck in a knee tuck. Two. Get a nice low lateral lunge. Three. Chest up. Four, all the way through that heel. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And 12, five seconds. All right, I'm gonna do this one actually with my 10 pounds. Sumo, down, curl, jack in and out. All right, 12 reps. Here we go, so down, curl, stay low, in, out, that's one. Back to your curl. Two, three, stay low. Curl, jack in, four. Five, six, seven, eight, 
nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Oh, all right. Deadlift, no weight. So deadlift down, pop it up, alternating. Here we go. So fingertips to the floor, balance. Not so easy now. One, focus. Two, 12 reps. Three, four, five. Leg comes up behind you. Six, just a single leg deadlift. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Flat back. Woo, get your balance. And twelve. Uh, ten seconds. We are doing. Kneeling to jump in, open close. So kneel, here we go, 12 reps. Jump in, stay low, open close just like that jack, that's one. You don't need to use your hands, don't. Two, just stay low. Three, four, Five, six, seven, low, 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 eight, nine, ten, eleven, last one, and twelve. If you have a bench, you're doing hop overs. If not, you're doing them on the floor. 24 reps. And go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, twelve, eleven, ten, nine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Oh, guys, 25 seconds. That was it for every minute on the minute. All right. And I am taking that rest. Last round in the whole workout is our compound loops again but we're doing them as Tabata pairs all right so box squat and clean and press is our first Tabata pair 20 seconds each move 10 second break which I personally really need to do all right so Finish it up, this is it. Four last compound moves, and we are done with this workout. Starting it up. Load up, we're starting with the box squats for 20 seconds. In three, two, and go. It's only 20 seconds of each move. Come on, four times each move. Three, two, and one. 10 seconds, clean, hang, clean, press. Two, and go. Three, two, and one. Box squats. Three, two, 
two, and go. Make sure your bench is behind you. Your pace, your speed. Five, four, three, two, and one. Clean and press. Three, two, and go. Ten seconds. Two, and one. Whew. Guys, I am drenched as if I just got out of the sea. Four, three, two, and go. Five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, and clean the press. Go. Three, two, and one. Last round. Four, three, two, and go. Three, two, and one. Hanging clean into a press. Final time. And you are done with these compound moves. Go. Five, four, three, two, and one. Oh, guys, I'm gonna water up. All right, we have our sumo deadlift high pull and our decline push ups. All right, so I might switch to my kettlebell because my heart rate, I'm glad I'm not wearing my watch because I'm pretty sure I died is out of the sky. There's really no roof. All right, so I'll do the first round with my bar, and then if I need to, I'm gonna go to my kettlebell if my heart rate feels so elevated. Here we go. Sumo deadlift, high pull, 20 seconds. In three, two, and go. Guys, this is it. When you finish these two moves, four times through each, we are done with this workout. Four, three, two, and one. Decline push-ups. Three, two, and go. Your own pace. If I were in my air conditioned normal gym, I would probably be moving a lot quicker, all right? But I'm not gonna push it. Five, four, three, two, and one. High pulls. I'll alternate, I'll use my kettlebell for this one. Give my heart rate a chance. Here we go, sumo high pull. So I'm setting my kettlebell to the ground if you're using a kettlebell. 
five, four, three, two, and one. Incline push ups. Three, two, and go. Guys, we are so close. Come on. If I can do this, anybody can do this today. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Zoom on high pull. I'll try to go back to my barbell. Three, two, get into position with the legs. Go. Doesn't matter if you lose a few seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Decline push ups. Three, two, and go. Chest to the ground. Squeeze. Five, four, three, two, and one. Last round. I'm going back to my kettlebell. Sumo squat. Two, and high pull. Go. Deadlifts. Two more squats. Doesn't come naturally as it does with the barbell. Five, three, two, and one. Last, final, final, final round. Push ups. Three, two, and go. Focus to the end. Ten seconds. Four, three, two, and one. O M G. I might have to go run into the scene with everybody else with my clothes on, guys. That I knew was gonna to be tough in this heat, but it was really tough in this heat. So I'm hoping you enjoyed it, but you did it in an air conditioned, more comfortable environment. I will keep trying to make these videos. Let me know if you have any suggestions. Not much I can do with where I'm recording at the moment, but I hope you guys enjoyed the change of scenery and I'll see you at 122. Thank you.